Hello, everyone. Hi, Nuno here. Today, I'm happy to announce that uh, we are updating uh, a feature that is core uh, is in the core of our system. Every day, many many users are creating loads uh, in the carrot TMS, and they are running a flow that was created a few years ago, having in mind a RAID confirmation structure. Although this flow has a, a logic associated with it, it's really hard for new customers to get used to this process and to uh, get along by using this process by themselves. So in result, what happens is whenever a new carrier uh, starts using the carrier TMS or a new employee is hired for a carrier using the carrier TMS, they have to go through a training to learn how to create a load because it's not intuitive. Having that in mind, uh, we have uh, created the, the flow to be something more uh, easy uh, for the users to, to know how to use and also address a few pain points that were there before. Let me show how it works. So basically, I will create a new node here. And when I click create a new node, I can see already the changes. So right now, in this new version, you can set up your basic information right away. So you can keep your customer or create a new customer if you want. Uh, so I'll pick here, just a demo customer. I can uh, set a load number or leave it empty and the system will create a load, a, load, a load number for me. I can pick here my load reference number, which refers to the PIL number for my broker or my shipper. I can set my dispatcher. If uh, I am a manager of everything, I can pick up a different dispatcher for my load. I can set up the load type and also the load rate here. Also, if needed, I can add extra charges right away. I can add supporting documents right away as well. And I have ways to upload my load documents. So I can upload here my rate confirmation. And also we had a, a, new, uh, a new place only for uploading uh, DOLs. So it's easy to upload the DOLs right away. Uh, after setting up everything, you can see that I can save the load because I need to set up at least one segment. So I'll add here uh, one box and I can pick up the uh, pickup address, uh, the delivery address. This is very similar to what was before. Uh, I'm picking different dates here just to give the driver time to drive between the two locations. And I can pick here uh, the driver. As you can see here now, we are filling automatically the driver rate. If the driver is paid by percentage based on the load rate. So uh, it's already filled here and everything fine. I can save the segment. If I want, I can add an additional segment, an additional stock to this load, or I can just save the load. So that's it. This is the new load creation flow. We hope that it can allow more customers to start using and taking advantage of the carrier TMS and the users that are already familiar to be even more productive uh, with those small tweaks in the process that can make uh, your life easier. That's it. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye.